Hello friends, welcome to our channel Tours and Foods. Today we are going to share a tour plan of beautiful Indian destination Leh Ladakh. In this video, we will going to share what are the most important places to visit here, where to stay, what to carry with you. As this is a high altitude region, you need to carry some extra stuffs with you and what the cost will be. Here is a 5 nights and 6 days tour plan of Leh Ladakh. But before we begin, we want to tell you some points which you must keep in mind while visiting Ladakh. You may feel high altitude sickness like lack of sleep, breathing problem or loss of appetite in Ladakh. So it is better to get acclimatized in Ladakh on the first day by taking ample rest and having light food. Don't forget to consult your doctor before visiting. Remember, age is not a factor in high altitude but physical fitness is. As this place is very cold, take plenty of woolen garments, extra pair of socks and comfortable shoes. Don't forget to carry basic medicine, flashlight or insect repellent here. Now let's start. Day 1 On day 1, after reaching Ladakh, first get acclimatized. In the evening, visit nearby Shanti Stupa. Located on a hilltop, Shanti Stupa is a beautiful Buddhist stupa. This stupa was built in the year 1991. Right now, other than the religious importance, it is one of the prime tourist attraction of the region due to its stunning location. You can get panoramic views of the surrounding mountain range. Day 2 On day 2 morning, after breakfast, go for sightseeing tour around Leh. First, go to visit Gurudwara Pathar Sahib. This sacred place is devoted to Guru Nanak Dev Ji. Numerous people come here to offer their homage to Lord Nanak Ji. From here, go to visit Magnetic Hill. This place creates an optical illusion of a downhill road as uphill. Next, visit the confluence of Zankar and Indus River. This is a scenic place where you can witness the distinct color of two flowing rivers and fresh nature. On your way back, visit Spitu Gompa. It is another Buddhist monastery of this region. Next, visit Hall of Fame at Leh. Hall of Fame is a museum in Leh which is constructed by Indian Army in the memory of brave Indian soldiers who sacrificed their lives in Indo-Pak War. After that, visit the Leh Palace. Day 3 on day 3 of your tour, visit Nubra Valley. It will take around 5 to 6 hours to reach Nubra Valley from Leh. On your way, cross the Khardungla Pass. It is a high mountain pass located at a height of 5,359 meters above the sea level. It is also the highest motorable mountain pass of the world. At Nubra Valley, you can enjoy ATV bike ride. The ride will cost around Rs 500 per person. But due to bike shortage, you may have to wait for a long. Other than ATV bike ride, you can enjoy a camel ride at Handa Desert. Day 4 On day 4 of your tour, go to Pangong Lake from Nubra Valley. It will take almost 7 to 8 hours to reach Pangong Lake from Nubra Valley. Located at a height of 4350 meters above the sea level, this beautiful lake is one of the famous tourist spots of the region. Due to its tranquility, the place attracts numerous tourists every year. The unique feature of this lake is its changing color. Day 5 On day 5 of your tour, return to Leh from Pangong. It will take around 6 to 7 hours to reach Leh from Pangong. On your way, visit Changla Pass. It is the third highest motor road in the world. Spend the night at play. Day 6 On day 6, head back to airport for departure. In this entire tour, you will have to stay at 3 places, Leh, Nubra Valley and Pangong. In all these places, good quality hotels are available which will cost around Rs 2500 for a double bedroom. I will share the hotel booking link in the description box below. Food here will cost around Rs 600 per person per day. For total package cost, please check the description box below. If you love this tour plan, then please like and share the video. 
Also, do let us know your opinion in the comment section below. Your opinion means a lot to us. Thanks for watching.